Hello friends, welcome back. Um, I hope you are enjoying your day today. All right, so today Abby and I are going to do something a little fun, but also you'll understand here in a second. So for those of you who are new, um, my mom passed away almost three months ago, sudden. Um, we had maybe four hours notice before she actually passed away. So it was a really hard time for our family. And I've been thinking ever since then, trying to either find necklaces for my sisters or some something to remember my mom by. I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't know what that was and I just didn't know what to do. But I wanted some way to remember her. And something that we, um, my sister talked about at her funeral was her text messages. Um, and I want you to listen to one of them. This is my mom. Hang on. This is about... This is this one is in November of last year. Hi, honey, it's Mom. Um, nothing urgent. I wanted to see how you're doing and ask you about a couple of things. So, when you have a minute, would you call me back, please? Bye. She left that same message on everyone's phone. You could ask every one of my siblings if they have that message on their phone. Every one of them will have it. And now we have saved it on our phones. We don't want to delete them. I think I was just watching an ad or a TikTok. I don't even know what it was, but it suddenly occurred to me what I need to do with that voicemail. So that's what Abby and I are gonna go do. So before I tell you, come and I'll show you.
All right. So um, that was more emotional than I thought it was going to be. Let me kind of backtrack and kind of explain. So I took my mom's voicemail. She leaves this voicemail on everyone's phone, like guaranteed. And they were able to take that voicemail and yeah, put it next to their really high intense microphone and recorded it into the bear. And then when we were naming it and doing a little birth certificate for my niece, um, I was like, oh, I have to name it. I don't know what to name it. And Abby, cute Abby here, she was like, well, it's sunshine. So um, maybe I'll just insert some of the videos from around my mom's death. You Are My Sunshine is her song. So sunshine is the bear's name. And then I was just gonna bring it home and have him put it in like the little Build-A-Bear box and then just kind of wrap it in the butcher paper and mail it to my sister. But then the lady was like, oh, if you're mailing this, let us just do it. I can have it mailed out tomorrow morning. And it's like $8. <laughs> it's like, all of a sudden I had this um, you didn't detachment to anxiety. I didn't want to let go of the bear. <laughs> Abby was like, just, it's okay, we can leave. My lady's like, no, if you need more time with the bear. I'm like, I think I need more time with the bear. I took it back out of the box and I needed to listen to it one more time and take some more pictures with it. Um, I don't we'll know. We'll probably like, see the bear again if we go to I know, I will. But I, it was just weird that I suddenly had like this emotional attachment to it now that it had my mom's voice in it. Obviously means that, that hopefully that translates to my sister. Hopefully she'll understand the full meaning of what I'm giving to my niece and to my sister. And I just hope, and maybe if you're watching this, um, I love you and <clears throat> sorry that mom doesn't get to know Olivia, but um, we'll tell her all about mom.